Hey everyone, welcome back to another mountain road ride, gravel ride of the week. Now you can see today is a little chilly. <laughs> um, we are well into December right now. I haven't done one of these gravel ride of the week videos for a while. I'm excited to do this. So as I was saying, before the camera decided to hit the ground, and now people are coming. Hey everyone, welcome back to Mountain Road Ride for another gravel ride of the week. So it's been a little while, but I am back and I'm really excited about this loop that I'm going to show you today. So where we are right now is uh, right here by the Potomac River um, in Riverbend Park. And today we are going to do a proper mixed gravel slash trails loop um, just to show off the versatility of a gravel bike and um, so i'm really excited about this one this one is really one of my personal favorites in the area where i get to test um, both my road riding skills as well as my um, my gravel trails slash shingle track trails um, and uh, just get a really good overall workout in it's not very long um, especially being a little chillier today i don't want to be out here for too long um, um, so we're gonna throw in around 26 miles just a little over 40 kilometers of riding today um, and uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix things up a bit so as I said we started things off here in the River Bend Park we're gonna now head through towards Great Falls Park which is the neighboring park from there we're gonna go through some of their trails um, onto some just public roads through a couple of neighborhoods that's gonna lead us down to a pedestrian footpath or a bike path and next to there we'll find lots of of uh, gravel side trail so that's going to be a nice little bit of gravel mix in there and then from there the real fun begins we're going to go through to a place called like fairfax and there you actually find tons and tons of just single track trails and that the mountain bikers have carved out through those woods and so that's where we're going to really be putting my current gravel bike setup to the test so i've recently added some hunt 650b wheels and also pirelli 50 millimeter tires on there um be on the lookout for those reviews in the future but um, today we're going to put them through the test on those single track trails that's going to be a lot of fun and then from the Lake Fairfax area we'll come back via some of the neighborhoods to the park yet again so uh, a nice mix of both gravel um, single track trails park trails open roads you name it this loop has everything in it so uh, i'll put the link to my blog post in the description below if you do want to follow along and get a little bit more detail about this route do check that out all right so without any further ado let's get out on the tracks and the trails and go and explore my mixed gravel slash trails loop right here in northern virginia <laughs> Spark. <laughs> All right, old carriage trail climb. Now, this is a good one. Nice leg tester. Next up, turning off of the old carriage trail, 
heading on to Ridge Trail. That was the awesome Ridge Trail. So now we basically come to the end of our stretch through Great Falls Park. Uh, right down there, we're gonna head onto the paved road. That's gonna lead us through to the next neighborhood. So from here on out, we're gonna head onto a bit of a road ride. Let's go check it out. <laughs> So this is where the real fun begins now. We have come over to the single track trails. We are just behind Lake Fairfax and we're gonna zip around on some of these mountain bike trails right now. This is gonna be a real fun part of this ride and it's also gonna be the part where these 650B wheels with the bigger tires are really gonna help me out. So uh, I'm looking forward to this spot. Let's go check it out on these trails. <laughs> yeah, no, you can really have endless fun out here on these trails. Um, I would suggest that if you come and try it out, be sure to bring some good tires. This is the beauty of a gravel bike. Roads, trails, gravel, you name it, you can take it. <laughs> Love it. All right, so now we've made our way through to the Lake Fairfax Park properly by now. And you can see all the campsites all around me. So this is a, a campsite throughout the year. Obviously now in the winter time, not a whole lot of people out here, but uh, what a playground. <laughs> Just love it out here. Incredible. So now after this, we're gonna bomb down a paved road that leads out of the park and then we'll be back on some more single trails that will head through to Great Falls. So heading back to Great Falls Park now and uh, we'll see those single trails up next. Check it out. Great Falls Village Center area. 
getting closer and closer to the finish line now. At the Great Falls Village area, you'll find the Old Brogue Irish Pub and Katie's Coffee Shop. A great pit stop at the end of the ride before you head past the scenic horse farms in Great Falls back to the start. I think you can tell by the wind buzzing through the audio that it was uh, fairly challenging from that standpoint. Um, by the end, yeah, I was uh, I was being pushed, you know. Um, but what I really like about this route is just the variety. Like I said in the beginning, it's a, such a cool route to go and try. Um, if you're ever in the area, do come and check it out because uh, you get a little bit of everything. If you've got the right setup, um, a gravel bike that can take both the road and also those trickier trails and in stride then you're all set up and obviously you know a mountain bike will be um, even better suited for some of those trickier trails um, and you could explore maybe even some of the trails that I could even take today so uh, what a ride all in all I really enjoyed it I hope you enjoyed this spin along and uh, if you do like this kind of content please be sure to check out the other gravel ride of the week videos on this channel and do subscribe um, we'll be back with plenty more Gravel Ride of the Week videos in the future. I'm Vion, until next time, enjoy your ride.